Joe, what's up, man? You all right? Good, Good to you. see you, man. Me too. Me Good too. to see you. Let me take you on the buses. Man, this is my home, man. For the next couple of years, this is home. Yes. This is the front lounge. Um, we got food and necessities and everything else, you know, cereal, whatever. Yeah, we got a, what else we got? You know, some juice, some water. I don't know, some hot pockets. I don't know, something. What else is in here? Milk, Lunchables. <laughs> Everything you need. We have all the bunks. Um, I think it's ten of us all together. This is my bunk. I don't. This is mine right here. This is my area. My bed. It's kind of messy. That's all. But yeah, this is our home away from home for the next two years, pretty much. We can go backstage. Go to the band dressing room. This is L from Philly. He keeping me straight. Have my drum sounding good. Have him sturdy. Have him not move him. Have him how I want. My boy, this is my man. Little bro killing, man. Trying to make sure he good. Man, for sure. For sure. What are you doing now? Yeah, what's what's inside here? What's inside here? Oh yeah, see? I'll show you some goodies. Show you guys some goodies. Maybe a little sloppy just. We might be a little sloppy, but we got some stuff. Alright. Sticks. There we go. Spare sticks. Spare hardware. Pedal. Barbaless. John? Look. You're on stage. Always What's on stage. How you doing? Look, we got my boy Blaze. He getting a haircut tomorrow. I'm doing a video for my stick company, bro. Just say what up, what up, what up. His birthday is tomorrow, guys. So. Happy birthday. <laughs> for sure. This is a little bit of what goes on backstage. Now this is the band. Dressing room and jam room. Ooh, look. Straight on time. This is the MD. This is Bernard Harvey. This is Joe from Big First. This is Scott. Music director. Yeah, this is our room. This is Julian. Guitar. Then we got DJ Tay. He about to take a nap. Look at him. I told him, look, we take naps. <laughs> nap time. Look, it's nap time. Nobody can sit down. Look, 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 look. We got a Pearl. Pure reference drum kit, 10, 12, 16 inch floor time, 20 inch kick, um, 14 by five and a half snare. Then I have a 14 by six and a half on this side. All Zildjian symbols, of course. And then you already know us in the stick caddy, Vic Firth, of course. But yeah, that's pretty much it. This is this is where we get down before the show. After the show, we pretty much come in here and like shed out, play whatever, or go to sleep, as you can see, or pretty much just chill, hang out. Can you play first now? Yeah, you only play a little bit now.
I pretty much moved to LA, man, just to um, expand my musical journey and to just pretty much get out on my own and kind of like grow up as a, as a man, per se. I moved out there at the age of 22, and now I'm 23, so I thought it was the perfect opportunity and the perfect place to move, different scenery, and to spend on music. That's why I moved to L.A. How many months are you in L.A. before you get the fever Um I was in L.A. from June until December before I got the Beaver gig. I got the Beaver gig in December. I started playing with Rita Ora, I think, in October or November. Oh yeah, they checking drums right now, yeah. Um, but I got the gig, the Rita Ora gig in like November or October. So I was playing with her before I started playing with Justin. And then like at the end of her tour in December, like as soon as we got back home, I got a call to do Justin's audition, so yeah, man, that's that's how everything came about. It's definitely a blessing. I don't know like how how it happened, but it happened fast. I was not expecting it to happen this fast, man. Number two, it'd be a dope place to just go and like um, get out on my own and just pretty much grow up. Hey, you know? yeah, one, two, one, two, hey, 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 yeah, check. Hey, yeah, one, two, hey, hey.